So you telling me? Yo, so you telling me? Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Danny J. Quick, and this is the Quick Comic Book Review. This week, I'm gonna be checking out a a preview comic that came out on um, this past week called Sorcerority by Mikhail Sebastian and George Watson, the artist by Mikhail Sebastian. Um, this book is um, being published by the Nor Caesar comic book group. Um, they got some really good titles coming out. I've been seeing a lot from them, but I follow Mikhail on Facebook. And um, as soon as he announced the title and put up some of the, the artwork, I was, uh, I was instantly interested in it. Um, you'll see here, you can see the 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 art. Mikhail's art is is, is dope. So I, I've I've been following him as an artist for a while, and um, I see that he's you know he created this this story, and uh, he and George Watson. I'm not familiar with George's work, but I'll definitely be checking it out. You can see here um, the title. They already got the page set up, and you can actually go in here and download a free preview of Sorcerority. Um, at norcesar.com backslash sorcerority so you know get in there and check it out i'm going to go ahead and review a, a little bit of it but i want you to go and, and download it and check it out for yourself um uh and here we go man let's get into it so right here the 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 title page or the 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 landing page for sorcerority you can see they give you a little description of it and says following the following in the footsteps of her late grandmother a young girl enrolls in the historically black coven and university of magic she soon discovers her enrollment into the school may not be entirely of her own choosing but instead the calculated actions of a higher authority in between her studies she uncovers her familial connection to the school's mysterious past as well as her pivotal role in its future Hmm. So right off the bat, you see we got you know, it's, uh, you know, sci-fi. Well, I don't say sci-fi, but it's fantasy. There's this fantasy world where magic exists. It's a historically black, you know, university. So um, when I saw Mikhail, I'm I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Uh, if it's if it's Michael or if it's something else, just please let me know. I won't. I'll I'll get it right next time. Um, but you see, I saw when he was posting about it on Facebook that he was saying it was, you know, Hogwarts meets uh, Hillman. So that's uh, that's just it has a lot of potential in, in my eyes. I, I see it as something that you can, you know, do a lot of great world building with. You see this diverse cast of characters, a lot of uh, a lot of female characters in here. You see um, your man with this dark cloak on and the skull on the shoulder of some kind of animal or something like that. And you got a, a wolf guy, you know, dressed up in a, in a fancy suit, you know, seeming like he might be a professor or something like that. So that's all that's all really interesting. The art really um, provokes it. Um, uh, a fantastical, you know, world here. And I, I really like that. So um, let's get into the actual review here. I am. Um, I really like this. I really, 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 really did. I am um, a lot of the art is just outstanding. Mikhail, he doesn't does, an, does an awesome job as an artist always. And um, the the introduction here is really good. It's wordy for me. It's you know it's a lot of words, but most comics, you know, they have to. You got to introduce the world. So it's just something you got to get through. The art is outstanding, but the lettering here could have, you know, y'all know I'm a graphic designer and I letter comics. I letter our, our comics. So, uh, I'm really hard on letterers cause like big blocks of text like this. And you know, it's, that's the, the, it's a little inconsistent, but you know, I'm sure they'll, they'll get that together as they, you know, go through this book. So like big, this right here, for example, this big block of text right here, it's, it's square and it's just a pain to read through it all. Even though it's got some good stuff in there from Harriet Tubman, a sorceress whose power was matched only by her courage and to the great warlock and even greater leader, leader, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. So there's a lot of good stuff in there. It's just, uh, it can be kind of a chore to read through, you know, large, just blocky blocks of text like this. But the art is outstanding. The world building is so great in it. Uh, you see these big, I'm, I'm guessing that's like some kind of, you know, summoning circle or whatever like that. So, or a compass, you see it's got the, you know, west and, and east, north, south all on there. So that's really cool. Like there's a lot of good visuals in this. This is one of my favorites here with the, you see the football field here where they talk about, uh, you know, competitive um 
competitive professions and, and stuff like that. I know in Harry Potter, I didn't read the books myself, but I did watch most of the movies. And, you know, they had the Quidditch tournament with the, I think it was called Quidditch, where they chased around the whatever. So, you know, that was a big part of that. I can see, you know, they're they're doing a lot of good world building with this already. This statue right here, um, I just want to know what what this person was what they did why this why they were great enough to have a, a statue built in front of them and this this big this is the money shot right here to excursia so i'm guessing that's the name of the the university you see the the statues here um, in front of the university people walking around like it's a regular campus it's it's really really it's really 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 well done and um like i said it's got a lot of potential you see the title card there so sorority and then um, later on, you get into, you know, you meet a character named Millie and um, it introduces her and her mother and, um, you know, tells about how um, I'm guessing the, the the potential for magic comes through the, um, the women in this universe. And it's just it's it's really interesting. And, I'm, you know, I'm here for it. I, I like it. And if they do a, you know, a Kickstarter, or if they do a, a Indiegogo or whatever they choose to do with it. Um, how are they put it out? I'm going to be there for it. I'm, I'm definitely going to check this book out based on this alone. So this is a really good, you know, introduction into the universe. And I and I'm I'm about it. I haven't I actually haven't checked out any of the other North Caesar titles yet. They got um, a bunch of them on their website that I've seen, and the art looks so dope. But I'm definitely going to be checking out Sorcerority. Um, I'll probably get into Prime Seven um, soon. I've, I've been seeing these, like I said, but I, I just haven't had a chance to check out and, su and subscribe to their their um their website here. So, like I said, Sorcerer is it's a free download. You can download it and check it out. I say, you know, take take a look and, and decide for yourself. But as you can tell, I'm already hooked. So um, that's all for me. If you got any comments or if you got any little tidbits about it that I don't know, leave them in the comments below. Let me know what you think. And um, like I always say, of course, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to survive. But until next time, stay vigilant, my friends. I'm out. So you telling me, yo, so you telling me if I